So, Carl, you're uh, set to play for the Barbarians against Warriors. Are you looking forward to playing at Six Ways? Yeah, it'd be good to get back to Six Ways after especially a few games there with, uh, while I was playing at Newcastle. Uh, it's always a good place to, to go and play and a lively at atmosphere. And what does uh, playing for the Barbars mean to you? Um, the, I guess the, you know, it's an amazing experience to play for the Barbars, uh, the history of the club, um, and, and to come together with a group of guys from all around the world and, and to you know, mould ourselves into a team over a week. It's... Um, it's for me. It's really about the spirit of rugby and, and meeting different guys and and enjoying a performance in the weekend. And what can fans expect to see from the Barbars out on the field? You know, I think we'd like we like to move the ball around and and to um, you know play the traditional Barbarian style. Um, you know, we've, we've got a week to put a few structures in place, so um, we'll be hoping to you know put those structures in place and, and to and to be really uh, competitive. And are there any guys that you're really looking forward to playing alongside? Um, yeah, there's a, few, a lot of guys, like a lot of Australian boys that I've seen in, in Super Rugby. Um, we've got a lot of African African fellas in the team as well. So um, always good to, you know, Mikey Harris and Luke Burgess and the guy, I know Aussie boys. Um, good rivalry with the Aussie boys of the Kiwis. So to actually play with them is quite a nice uh, nice experience. And if you could add um, any player to the Barbars, who would it be and why? Probably in his prime, I think we'd probably have to add Jonah. Um, for, for, for his, I've seen a few games of us with the Barbarians and I think he single-handedly beat Scotland uh, by himself one day so um, you know someone like him would be pretty handy.